Taking a look at Philadelphia. Well, Greg, we know it's an uphill battle from here. Down three games to two, and there's no wiggle room. Yet there is some reason for optimism. Yeah, I mean, they've already proven, Kev, they can win. They've done it twice in this series. They're home. They've adjusted to everything that's been thrown at them. We'll see if they can do it again here and even things up. Here are the starters for Milwaukee. Middleton, the small forward, with Giannis Antetokounmpo as the power forward. Derrick Rose is out there with Holiday, and it's Nance in at the center, locking down the middle. Maxi, no good. You're not going to see that very often. Plenty of space, but he just basically moves on it. And the call on the shot sends him to the line. That one on Maxi. Yeah, credit Holiday for getting to the line on that one with his quickness and length. I'd like to see him do that more often. down the first one. All three throws, good from Drew Holiday. And it's a luxury to have a great shooter like him at the line. Very rarely see a miss. Maxi passes to Harris. Maxi against Holiday. Embiid with a screen on Holiday. And that one's good, Maxi. And once it got to the 10, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. Easy possessions like that literally are just a gift. You just dream of them. You'll gladly take those. Now here's Nance. Rose sets the screen for Middleton. And a miss there on the triple. I now I'll send it over to the sidelines and get a report from David Aldrin. Well, I was able to talk with Doc Rivers for a minute. I asked him if he thinks they can muster the energy and effort it takes to win two straight elimination games. He said, absolutely. But we're not going to think about two games at once. We can't think about game seven. We have to focus on tonight. Well, that's a true coach, Kevin. Back to you. Thank you, David. Now Middleton. To the miss three from Tyrese Maxey. Here's Antetokounmpo. That one's in his first bucket of the game. He's one for two. Savvy play from Holiday. Quick thinking helps him get the ball to the wide open man. Pass to Harris. It's tipped. Here's MP. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. It's his first trip to the line. First team foul. At the line for your sixer, Joel and Two shoot two. And the first one at the line is good. A scoring machine. There's just no shot and beads and afraid to take. And MB drops them both. Some big guys struggle at the line. Not him. He's put in the work to defy that assumption. For Milwaukee, they've gone one of three from the field to start this one so far. Here's Yuck. Played in with a nice touch off the glass. And I really marvel at the touch of Antetokounmpo for his size and physique. That's incredible. Now, here's Maxi. And the rejection by Adekumbo. And that one's good, Maxi. And it's Rose with the ball for Milwaukee. Pass it to Adekumbo. Nice ball movement by Milwaukee. Hands the screen on McCollum. A baseline chain. And he gets that one to go off the front iron. And Rose continuing to hone it, that jump shot. That's where he can take his game to the next level. And the 76ers decide to take their first time out here.
Kyle Lowry. He's checked in for Maxi. They've gone 2 of 5 here, making 40% so far to start out the game. Pass to Embiid. And first quarter, we're about three and a half minutes in. To the inside, McCollum. That's good, and that's Embiid with the assist. Nice pass by Embiid, smartly taking advantage of a wide open man. And Milwaukee calls their first time out of the game. Every time out, a chance to review the lineups, matchups, or call a play. I'm sure all of the above is in order, and you can never be too content. making a switch here. Wara checked in. First quarter of play and uh, just over three and a half minutes in. Goes against Harris. And they call the foul, so a chance at the line for one more coming up. Just a big time finish by Harris. One more coming at the line. First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. Personal foul. Second team foul. What's up? At the line for your sixers, Tobias Harris. That's good from Harris. A good percentage from here. Harris over 80% for his career. The pass to Moore. Here's Holiday. Let's it go from deep. Rebound by Joel and D. And their offense is really clicking right now. Playing with a lot of energy and really taking it to the defense. They've wasted no time settling into their offense. Bucks trail by six. Holiday, the pass to Moore. Middleton outside. Milwaukee, no good that time either. And so it's Harris who will bring it up for the 76ers. The results in their game on Sunday left no doubt. You know, those road games are tricky, but, but they had a good strategy going in and stuck to what they do best. Yeah, despite the challenges of being away from home, they were able to execute cleanly and look really fresh out there. The defense just giving him the easy look there. He's not going to miss that. And B pitched him a color. Lowry passes to Harris. Embiid with the screen on Middleton. Just four to shoot. He had a nice open look right there. McCollum's got eight. 
Their play on both ends has been superb. We, we'll see if they can maintain the momentum. They came out and bum-rushed them. Huge difference in activity level from both teams tonight. Now a timeout called by Milwaukee. Philadelphia making a change here. Jackson's checked in. Big group substitution here for Milwaukee. Tony Snell's checked in for Nance. Antetokounmpo comes in for Chris Middleton. Alec Burks checked in for Drew Holland. And it's Dante DiVincenzo in for Derrick Rose. DiVincenzo against Lowry. Looking around. Outside, out of the Kumbo. Six to shoot. Shoots over MB. Milwaukee, no good that time either. Now you can't look at the result of that shot. They'll take that whenever they get it. Yeah, it's a great look for him. One they'll try and manufacture again. Those are the shots you want him to take. Burks in the corner. Loads it up for Giannis. An emphatic LU jam. And one of the most athletic players in the league. Giannis makes those alley oop jams look easy. Pass to Jackson from beyond the arc. Another three for Philadelphia. Defensively, giving up far too many open rhythm looks. They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Too many empty possessions right now. They need a basket. And he hits it and gets hacked on the play. A three-point possibility if he can convert the free throw. Just a positive force right now for these guys. And though his team has fallen a bit short, it's not because of him. Catching up on the changes for Philadelphia. Blake Griffin, he's checked in for MB. Harris comes in for Matisse Thibault. And Maxi subbed in for C.J. McCollum. Andre Bembry's checked in for Milwaukee. The 76ers leading by 10. Jackson dishes to Lowry. This is it to Harris. Here's now, guarded by Harris. A shot by Alvaro. Nobody around. That's another one for him. His fifth in just seven shots. And this is an area where Giannis wants to improve. I think the key for him to continue to grow is to shoot those with confidence. Now here is Harris. Tries from seven. And the 76ers tack on two more. Yeah, they, they have gone full throttle from the opening tip, showing no signs of letting up. Yeah, they're in control on both ends of the court, and it's always impressive when you build a double-digit lead in the first quarter. Now Lowry following Alec Brooks's three-point attempt. The feed now to Harris. And he drives in, and the rejection by Adetokounmpo. Even Genzo with it, and Griffin picks him up defensively. Burks kicks to DiVincenzo. Connects from three-point range. 
We've got 22 seconds left here in the first quarter. Outside Lowry. Jackson setting the pick here for Lowry. And that one, good. And the 76ers lead by nine. Oh, nice drive by Lowry. Cutting the defense to pieces and then getting himself open for a look. And so it's the Philadelphia 76ers in control with a nine-point lead to end the quarter. Their shooting has been the big key. Their percentage from the field so far has been terrific. We'll return shortly. Good to have you with us for 2K Sports coverage of Game 6. And a look at how the offensive approach has been going here so far for the 76ers. Here is Lowry. Tyrese Roxy out there with Lowry. And there's Jackson. And there's Embiid. And it's Thibel in at the small forward. That's the group on the floor for Philadelphia. Unwilling to let up, even for a moment. That's his killer instinct, just fanning the flame. Always plays hard until the final whistle, no matter what the situation is. Giannis against Embiid. Lowry passes to Maxi. Philadelphia moving the ball around. Here's Lowry with the drive. Up and in on the layup. He's got the lead up to 14 now for the 76ers. And it's Antetokounmpo with the ball. He'll bring it up for the Milwaukee Bucks. Outside Rose. Back to Antetokounmpo. Like at six. And the dunk by Giannis. Love it when Rose looks to share the ball, especially when his teammates are open like that. Wow, he passes to Maxi. And Bede with the screen on Rose. Bible for three. Doesn't go for him. So Milwaukee will take it the other way. Down low. And the dunk by Giannis. And we talk about Antetokounmpo's all-around skills. And tonight, it's been about the score. He's put this offense on his back. Now here's MB over Giannis. No good off the back of the rim. Three off the mark. Not quite enough defense. That time around, just lucky he was off. Maxi passes to Lowry. Fires the three. And so it looks like the 76ers will retain possession here. And the 76ers call time here. Every time out, a chance to review the lineups, matchups, or call a play. I'm sure all of the above is in order, and you can never be too content. Tobias Harris is checked in for the 76ers. McCollum comes in for Kyle Lowry. The Bucks also with the sub. Wara checked in. And a 
wide open look for McCollum. Good on the three-point shot. McCollum's got 11 points. And there's the steadiness to McCollum's game. He's going to contribute from deep almost every game. It's becoming a given. Now here's Rose over McCollum. That one's rebounded by Embiid. Well, Iron, that's what you get when you go for style points with the fadeaway. And look, he paid the price. And Embiid throws it down. Just a beautiful job of scanning the floor, finding the open man. Harris looking to involve his teammates. Here's Laurel. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. The edge on the glass is the difference. It's allowed them to build this lead. Now here is Harris. Cullen passes to Embiid. And they double up Embiid. Back to McCollum. Pass to Thiper. Down to five on the shot clock. Now Harris covered by Nance. Harris's shot is off. Bucks trail by 15. Mora, the pass to Middleton. Rose with the ball. Now defended by McCullough. Holiday gets the bucket. Oh, a nifty finisher. You didn't think Holiday would back down inside, did you? Now the pass to Thiper. To the middle. There's Embiid. And one step ahead of the defense with that solid screen. And then Greg, the monster dunk to finish it off. Oh, great chemistry on display. He understood where to put the screen in order to free up his teammate. Holiday gets the bucket. And I love Holiday's shot selection. Fantastic at realizing when he should shoot off the catch. Colin passes it to Harris. Over Nance. And he overshot that one, missing. Bucks trail by 12. Mora, the pass to Rose. Middleton outside. It's tipped. Eibel with the ball. And Rose picks him up defensively. McComb outside. With some arc. Here's Norrell, defended by Feibel. Rose, and another basket for Milwaukee. And this is who Rose is. This guy's a warrior, never backing down from an aggressive defense. And the 76ers call time here. Check in for Philadelphia. The box also changing it up. Johnny Snell's check in for Nance. Antetokounmpo comes in for Chris Middleton. And it's Dante DiVincenzo in for Derrick Rose. Lowry against Holland. And here's McCollum for three. Rebounded by the Bucks, And on an open look like that, he's very good at making the weak coverage go. Holiday looking over the floor. Back to Andre Kumbo. 
Shot clock at five. Fades and shoots. And another basket for Milwaukee. And to me, this is the perfect spot for a Giannis jump shot. Keeps the opponent honest. Lowry against Holiday. Here's Embiid. The 76ers with another miss. Bucks trail by eight. Inside. Holiday with it. Lowry picks him up. Holiday gets the bucket. Holiday's got seven points for the quarter. His accuracy is on another level this quarter. Really high quality shooting. Lowry kicks to Embiid. McCollum outside. Shoots over DiVincenzo. And good. That's the friendly bounce off the right side of the rim. You want to know why they're winning? It's because of his play offensively. Holiday with the three. And again, Milwaukee with the triple. He's looking much more confident here in the second quarter as far as the scoring goes. McCollum outside. And B with the screen on DiVincenzo. McCollum kicks to Thibault. That ball. Nice feed that time from McCollum. Bible's got himself on the board with three there. And an eye for an eye. Both teams working to stretch the floor. This is today's NBA. Hey, we see this kind of exchange more often than not. Now a timeout called by Milwaukee. Checked in for Harris. Milwaukee also making some changes. Embry's checked in for Giannis Antetokounmpo, and Alec Burks subbed in for Drew Holiday. Bucks trail by eight. DiVincenzo kicks to Bembry. McCollum against Burks. And it's Philadelphia with the rebound. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. Oh, McCollum in position. Lowry against DiVincenzo. Dishes it to smell. It's over Embiid. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. And, and I like the fact that the defense is looking to protect the rim at all costs. For Milwaukee, they have made two of their previous three free throws in today's game. That's good from Snell. That one misses. The 76ers leading by seven. Bible, the pass to McCollum from deep. Another three for Philadelphia. And he's capable of turning it up on offense. When the top catches fire, 
This is a guy that can get uber aggressive. About seven seconds of putting the shot in the game clock. It's the smell. He dishes it to Burks. And right away, they match it with a three-pointer of their own. Burks has got himself going there. His first points of the game on the deep ball. And beat inside. Again, Philadelphia. This is why they feed and beat. His teammates trust his ability to get the job done. CJ McCollum, he's feeling it tonight and has been the driving force for the Philadelphia 76ers. He ends up dropping in two from distance, making a difference from long range in this one. BA playoff round one. Thanks for joining us as we get back to the action on the court. You know, C.J. McCollum has been exceptional here, guys. He's done a fantastic job of finding open space to operate within the first few quarters. I like how they came into this one with a game plan, and they're just going out and executing it. Terrific job. Well, it doesn't get much better than playoff basketball. Let's get back to the action here in round one. And on the floor for Mike Budenholzer starting the second half. A talented pair of Middleton and Giannis in at four. Holiday out there with Derrick Rose. And it's Nance in at the five down low. Now here's Adi de Kumbo following the missed shot by Tobias Harris. Two free throws coming up and they call the shooting foul. That one on MB. And you see Middleton on the perimeter a lot, but he's really been trying to add strength to that 6-8 frame so he can mix it up a little more inside. And the first one drops. Middleton hits them both. And so it's Maxi with it. He brings it up for the 76ers. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. Yeah, indeed, just terrorizes defenses on the inside. Good luck guarding the big four. And this is his second trip to the line in the game. good on the free throw and the second free throw good Bucks trail by eight passes it to Giannis Now here is Holiday. Kicks it to Rhodes. No good. Shot missing. Good D by McCollum. And that's the battle they haven't been winning today. Their work on the glass has been porous, and that's got to change. And to the Kumbo finds Nance. To the paint. Here's Hunter to Kumbo. And Hunter to Kumbo slams it in. And that move has become second nature for Giannis. Once he establishes position, game over. Harris looking it over. And B touch the pick for Harris. And they pick up two. Harris has got his third bucket of the night. I know what they say. Defense wins championships, but you need some bucket getters too now. Pass to all the Kumbo. The box working the ball around. He gets that one. And this is something Middleton's improved over time, converting through contact. Holiday against Maxi. Near the three-point line, it's McCollum. Misses the jumper. That's one for their first four to start the second half. Onto the Kumbo, dishes to Rose. Hands in the post. He's guarded by McCollum. 
Of 76ers leading by six. Here's Embiid. Good D by Giannis. Yeah, the offense scuffing a bit to start this second half. Only one for the first five. Basket, good. And what I like about Nance Jr. is how he positions himself. Knows his strengths on offense and plays to them. Now here's Embiid. He's got 11. Here's Maxi. That's good, and that's Embiid with the assist. Embiid's got three assists in the game. And there's the call on Joel Embiid. That's his fourth foul of the contest. Bucks trail by six. Right around three minutes into the second half. Holiday with the three. He scores his fifth field goal. He's taken nine shots to get those five. You gotta respect the range of Holiday if you're the D, showing he can hurt you from that area. Harris outside. Feeds it to Embiid, and Embiid throws it down. Textbook, nice pass, great catch, even better catch. Rose passes to Giannis. And the slam dunk by Hunter Takumbo. Oh, I dunk you very much. Yeah, he, he can really fly, and you combine that, Craig, with some nice penetration, too, and you've got two points. And Philadelphia calls time here. the 76ers making a change here. Eibel's checked in. Milwaukee also making some changes. Wara checked in, and it's Dante DiVincenzo in for Derrick Rose. over three and a half minutes through the third quarter of play now. And the pass to Harris. And Bede with a screen on names. Harris drives in. Rebounded by the Bucks. Juarez got his sixth rebound on the night. No other way to put it. Just a poor shooting performance for him. But luckily, his teammates have picked up the slack. Oh, just solid on the one-handed slam. And guys, when it's a tight ball game like this, he's the guy they want with the ball. Now here's McCullough. 16 points for him. Embiid against Giannis. And it's Thibault in the corner. Just two to shoot. Puts it up from 17. The 76ers again can't hit it. Bucks have gone six of eight on field goal attempts in the third. A 75% clip. So they take the lead. Yeah, nice silky finish on the alley oop from the stupendous feed. That sequence couldn't have been executed any better. And Bede with a screen on DiVincenzo. Here's against Nunes. And the rejection by Adekumbo. And a lot of attention on onto the Kumpo's offense, but don't sleep on the D. He, he can defend every part of the court and does it with intensity. 
and let's get your take, guys, on the hustle stats for Milwaukee. He's 0-1 from the line, missing on his first trip. And the 76ers making a change here. Howard's checked in. No good for out of the Kumbo. The 76ers trail by three. Outside Lowry. Shot to stop the run. And he lays it up and in. Lowry's got six points. And just so crafty around the hoop. Lowry probably six feet at best, but and he can slip inside and score with the best of them. Pass to Lunch Kumbo. On the wing. Yes, and it's Holiday with the assist that time. Holiday's got three assists in the game. Passes it to Harris. Embiid with a screen on names. Here's Harris. And he comes up with the deuce. He's got nine. Defense comes at Harris hard inside. But he is physical right back. If you hit first, it hurts last. Holiday to pass to Yon. Here's Mora. And again, Milwaukee with the triple. You've got to give them a lot of credit for just battling back into this game. And it's so much easier said than done. But now it's all about keeping that momentum going for them. Holiday, the pass to Nance. And Embiid pulls it down. Passes the bucket. Well, like you expect him to make. It's tough when you miss those. And again, Philadelphia turns it over. Some changes for Philadelphia. Blake Griffin, he's checked in for Embiid. Jackson comes in for Tobias Harris. And McCollum subbed in for Maxi. The box also changing it up. Tony Snell's checked in for Nance. Chris Middleton comes in for Giannis Antetokounmpo. And it's Rose in for Drew Holiday. Now, here's DiVincenzo. And the shot goes in. DiVincenzo's got the lead up to six now for Milwaukee. And not quite as aggressive from outside as they were in the first half. Sticking to the high percentage shots. Playing smart with the lead. McCollum up top. He's covered by Rose. Jackson setting the pick here for Lowry. Hangs home the trifecta. Lowry's got nine. Can't let Lowry get comfortable from beyond the arc because he's more than capable of hurting you from there. Got a piece of it. And stolen by Feibel. Pass to Lowry. He feeds it to McCollum. Headshot off. And Milwaukee will come the other way. Middleton outside. The pass to Rhodes. And the layup's good off the glass. Rose has got his third basket of the night. And when Rose goes on the attack, he stays on the attack. Fights his way through the contact. McCollum kicks to Jackson. Here's Lowry, and the quarter ends with some slight win defense right there. And offensively, a great show for the fans through the first three quarters. It's been a fun game to watch. Bucks lead by five. And coming up as soon as we return from break, the fourth quarter gets underway. And it's time now to bring you our State Farm assist of the game. Yeah, an easy choice tonight. Look at the precision on this pass. Put it on a platter for him. You've got to admire the vision just as much as the accuracy. Not many players can even spot that pass. NBA playoff round one. Thanks for joining us as we get back to the action on the court. Lowry out there with Tyrese Maxey. Then it's Joel Embiid. Then there's Matisse Thibel. And it's Jackson in at the four. That's the group on the floor for Philadelphia. And here's Embiid. He'll bring it up for the 76ers. Outside Jackson. Right block shot. And the rejection by Adetokounmpo. Count 
the bucket, and he's got a free throw coming up as well. How many times have we seen a possession like that from them today? Ending with a basket coming off a pretty pass. Sixers trail by seven. No one near Maxi as he lets it fly. That's good, and it's Embiid with the assist. Embiid's got four assists now to it. Holiday, the pass to the Kimball. Somehow ignores the tight D and gets the way up. Onto the Kumbo's got 14 points here in the second half. Mowry deciding where to go with it here. Indeed, just five on the clock. Another three for Philadelphia. Defensively, they just look out of sync. Not closing down on the three. Holiday, the pass to Andre Kumbo. In shot opportunity, and the layup is good. Donos has got 32 points in the game. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. Pass to Embiid. It's all about it's a Kumbo. Pass to Snell. And Embiid pulls it down. Embiid's got nine rebounds in the game. Getting it done. And there's the pass to Fife. And here's Embiid. Burks covering. Takes it from 10. Again, Philadelphia. The offensive arsenal of Embiid is phenomenal. He's capable of scoring in a multitude of ways. Timeout called the Bucks. Just a little under two and a half minutes of pass now here in the fourth. That's to Bembry. Hurts on the wing. He's covered by Max. Scott has a screen on McCollum. And again, the Bucks miss. And so it's Harris who will bring it up for the 76ers. McCollum outside. Bible for three. That ball. Nice feed that time for McCollum. Bible's got it all tied up now for the 76ers. Here's Young. And Hunter Takumbo slams it in. Yeah, that, that's careless defense, though. I mean, he's one player you can ill afford to let run free. He just loves to be a money player in the fourth quarter. Maxi finds Harris. Here's Embiid again, Philadelphia. And we're about three and a half minutes into the fourth quarter. Passes it to Burks. Fires for three. Sinks the triple. And the Bucks lead by three. Pick works well there. Not much resistance from the D. Yeah, that just comes down to a lack of effort. The defender has to do a better job fighting through the screen. Now here's MB. Stripped away. Down low. Nice break. Galaki and the slam dunk by Antetokounmpo. And big men aren't supposed to move that well in the open floor. Uh, that's a big reason Giannis earned the name the freak. Throws against McCullough. Maxi, another three for Philadelphia. Yeah, they're relying on their three-point shooting and getting pretty good to go. Throws in the post. He is guarded by McCullum. And the rejection by Embiid. Bible, the pass to McCullum. And here is Harris. Outside, Maxi just five to shoot. To the inside. Here's Embiid. That's down the hatch. Not one more to his total. That's nine for 15 shooting. And no doubt the ball is going to go to Embiid there. Needing a bucket, and he gets it. 
and, and got to like what they've been doing down low in the post. Popped up there for Embiid. Takes the alley-oop pass and dunks it down. I like whenever Embiid's teammates use his size and throw it anywhere near the rim because he finishes it. Timeout called the Bucks. The Bucks trade. Giannis picks the names. McCollum against Rose. Pass to Holiday. Hands a screen on Maxie. Milwaukee, no good that time either. And even without that three ball dropping for him, the defense should have done more on that last play. Good ball movement here by the 76 And Embiid throws it down. Oh, what a dunk by Embiid. He's just doing big man things the way big man should. Hands sets a screen three up. Good on the triple. Giannis has got 39. And he just seems to always deliver in the clutch. And, and he's got it going right now. That's who they want taking the big shot. Now, here's Maxi. The pass to Embiid. And they double up Embiid. Taken away by Holiday. One forty-four left in the fourth quarter of this one. It's stolen by Harris. Pass to Maxi. He's looking for Embiid and finds him. The shot's good. And a breakdown here, guys. The hustle starts for the 76er. Giannis against Embiid. Outside Holiday. Here's Hunter to Kubo. And he gets the friendly spin, and that one drops. Giannis has got 41. And a big time playmaker when the game is up for grabs to give the rock to Giannis. And they double up and beat. Six to shoot. And beat with a screen on Middleton. Look, there's the 24 second shot clock violation, so they'll turn it over. And that is an absolute heartbreaker of a turnover. In a close game like this, that might be enough to impact how it ends. Always good to get another look at a terrific defensive play. And well, they didn't make it this far by giving up easy ones. And now the defense is in overdrive. Onto the Kumbo, looking it over. Money! Oh, he just loves to be a player with action. Absolutely no fear. He knew what they needed here and was determined to deliver. And Philadelphia calls time here. Here's McCollum. Freibold, the pass to McCollum. Embiid against Andre Kumbo. Embiid, no good. And so Giannis will bring it up to the Milwaukee Bucks. They lead by one. Hands sets a screen free up. And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. A big trip for Giannis. Normally at the strike, he's better in the pressure moment. second and that will put them up by two and Philadelphia calls time here so it's Philadelphia now to the middle got a piece of it it's thrown by Jacumbo and there's the call on Joel Embiid and 
and so he's picked up his final foul. And he will sit for the rest of this game. And guys, this is where their depth really comes into play. They, they've got such talent at that position. They'd love to have him out there, but they won't suffer much of a drop-off. He drops the first one, and that makes it a three-point lead. And Middleton has proven to be clutch before. Not the guy you want to foul in close game. And so he drops them both. It's a four-point ball game. Calm and cool, and his free throws put a bow on this one. Nice way to finish the game up. And what a sensational bucket to bring them within one. Well, and this has been their strategy throughout the fourth period. We'll see how it pans out. I think when you've got it going from three-point range, you've got to keep it going. It's a good way to kind of pile up the points quickly. drops and that will put them up by two and the grizzled veteran rose no stranger to having to up the end and come up close and so both free throws are good and it's a three-point game and those were some big time shots those free throws helping make this a three-point game nice work to rise up and secure that list solid rebounding effort from him Honestly, just doing what they have to in order to get the basketball back. Semifinal. It took them six games to do it, Greg, but they finally asserted themselves and move on to round two.